Well, hello everyone, GameTrovert here, and welcome back to Cities Skylines. We're taking a gander in one of our low-density neighborhoods, and in the distance is the burgeoning downtown Newberryville. I've got about 25,000 residents, i got a buck fifty and millions in the bank, and we're doing good. One problem, though, we have a little bit of a garbage issue in the downtown. That is because garbage pickup is not optimal. Our guys are up here. They're just about the opposite caddy corner, and even though they have ways to get down here, we might want to set up like a uh, little garbage area down here. And I'm thinking in like this corner. I don't know. This might be prime real estate, so maybe right here. I'm not sure exactly how I want to do this. So let's figure this out. All right. So we have the six-lane road here. So I think the six-lane road should continue on uh, this way right here yeah let's do that let's kind of continue the curve just a little bit not too crazy to right here page up you know what let's make that straight we'll make a little uh, overpass if we can there we go there we go and then let's do the on-off ramp system. Just this is the classic, if you will, on-off ramp system that was developed by the Germans at the Autobahn. Yeah. There we go. And then maybe we can do some garbage right here, like real close. Not this really nice, you know, super duper close to the highway. What is not optimal real estate? Not the best. There we go. And then we'll just set up some garbage, just some incinerators right next to the highway to dump the smelly burning garbage let's do three shall we and then these guys should I would imagine prioritize downtown and they don't have any water and they won't have electricity I did not think this through okay so let's give these guys water and while we're at it since we are seem to be expanding pretty quickly, let's give everyone over here some water. What are you? That's weird. What did I do? Oh, that's the Dumbo District. Huh. Huh. Dumbo District. Okay. And then one more. Um, right there. Y'all got water. Do, 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 do. Give them water. You got water, right? Yeah, you got water. And I don't think they need electricity. And oh boy, I'm dropping frames real bad. What the heck? There we go. And I guess these guys don't need electricity to run. And then looks like um, I would hope that the garbage guys go in there. Let's see. They're the purple dudes. Go, purple dudes, go! So many intersections. But traffic doesn't seem to be too bad. Please take a right, purple trucks. There we go. Take a right, and then please take a left. Hooray! They're picking up the garbage! Hooray! Now I won't have... The plague spreading through my city. Okay, and in the meantime, I've had a little bit of a in uh, residential demand pick up. So let's make these interior spots residential. And look at that; they're already popping up. And then another thing that I definitely noticed that I needed. What is this? What is that? Oh, that's the underground tunnel. I think I did that exact same mistake in the last episode. Um, these guys don't have buses. They have no buses whatsoever. Um, everyone up here has busing. 
but there's no busing down here. So let's get some buses going, huh? Um, do we want to do the whole loop deal with uh, these buses up here? I think we do. So let's make a stop. The downtown stop can be create new line there. Okay. And then hopefully they'll whip around here. And let's just guess that they're going to come in this way. So they're, I'm going to make one like big loop and then one like little bitty loop. That sound, that's a, the, the, I think that sounds good. That sounds good. I want to, I want to make sure that they take the interstate. No, they don't, I guess they don't have to. Okay. One big loop. Here we go. First stop right here, this commercial district. Doink. And then you can stop. These guys will stop on the main road. Right? Maybe make a stop here. And then eventually, I mean, I'm going to expand this way, right? So make a stop here, here, here. And then we'll finish the line. Complete line. There we go. And then we'll make one more, like, just in intra-downtown, right? That kind of weaves in and out of the downtown buildings. So let's start here. Let's go this way. This way. Everyone's so happy, baby. I love making my sims happy. I call them sims. Are they really sims? Like... Sim City Sims? I don't know. And then we'll come down here. Here. Go up into here. Can you get out here? Make a stop here. Go up here. And a boosh. And a boosh. There we go. I think that should do decent. And then we'll make like another intra in this neck of the woods. We have, wow, I've never seen my residential that low. Where are we at? Okay, looking at my time. And one last thing that I think I wanted to do. Let's just take a gander at everything around here, making sure that, uh, oh, it, we're paused. Someone died in the park. It's not good. Too much, uh, too much toxic fumes from Smog Central. One other thing that I think I wanted to do was try to do a passenger train. Where's it at? Train station. To do a passenger train that took people straight from the downtown, straight up here. Do you think that'll work? I think it'll work. I hope it works. And it will. Uh, I'm definitely not going to let it connect to this at all. It's not going to interfere what whatsoever. So here, where's the passenger train terminal? We'll put you up right here. By the, by the college, or should it be like... Yeah, I think it should be by the college. Okay, and then where do we want your counterpart to be? How are you not getting electricity? Oh, there we go. Okay, and then I think your counterpart can be down... Hmm. Should I make it on this four-lane road? I real when it comes to these trains, I can't because it's too curved. Okay, I could make you there. Maybe make you right here. You got noise pollution, but this is a big debate. Let me let me take a quick second and think about it. Okay, I think I made a decision. I'm just gonna do it right here, cause why not? It's close to a bus. It's uh, walking distance to a metro line. Let's do it. Let's hope that this isn't a grievous mistake. All right, and then we need to connect them with rails, which thankfully can go underground. Huzzah. And then we can go here, here, 
page up, and then we can rise up, boys. And we can kind of uh, follow this and go up there. Do we want to do that? Can I delete you? Uh, I can't delete you. Okay. There we go. Train terminal. Ahoy. Fun, fun. Excellent. Now we might want to kit this out with like walking paths to it. Um, let's do that right now, actually. While I'm thinking of it, just to optimize that people's ability to get to this place. Can I thread the needle here? No. I can thread the needle there, though. Excellent. And then make a little crosswalk there. Anyone using it? No one's used it yet, but it, I just made it. All right, now let's go see our other one. Hopefully that can uh, this can help out a bit. Now, did I make a bus line, like a bus stop right outside? It would have been nice if I would have made a bus stop right outside. Uh, right next door. That kind of works, I guess. If people get off and then want to... I think that's actually what these people are doing. Are you doing what I thought you were doing? Go in. Hey, yeah, that one guy went in. Very cool. All right. So, uh, got a little train terminal. Still kind of growing slowly. I was dipping down. Uh, did I lose money? Oh, yeah. Well, because I just built a bunch of stuff. Duh. So it looks like we have some more basically across the board needs. And um, I was actually looking at the rest of Newburyville, and it's kind of like awkwardly, awkwardly spaced out. I mean, there's like gaps and stuff in here. So let's fill, let's fill these gaps in why don't we huh I mean come on now gotta make Newburyville look good some low density houses gonna grow in here I kinda filled this in as best I could I did this when I still had a train coming through here so let's see if we can't kind of let's see if we can't You're gonna destroy that walking path, but that walking path is stupid, even though this guy's using it. You know, and we don't need necessarily to. We can have a dead end, right? We can have a dead end street. Ain't no rules against that. Okay, some itty bitty houses right there. See if anyone moves into this neighborhood. Oh, a little gap in my water coverage. Look at that. Look at them apples. That should be good. All right, yep, some people are moving in. Very cool. Interesting little nugget right there, but, you know, whatever. Um, let's see, where else can we fill in? Let's, uh, for the time being, let's fill in some more high-density commercial in Disha neck of the woods. I'm, I'm not sure if it's smart to have all my high density in like one place, but they emit noise pollution. So I don't want it like interspersed with, where's the noise? I don't want it interspersed with, you know, my residential and stuff, you know? Oh yeah, I see some dinging, some upgrading you guys. Do I have any level four houses? Not yet, so what are these guys missing? They're educated somewhat. They have transportation, they have health, they have fire, they have police, they got water. Do they need parks? Is that what it is? Maybe? Oh yeah, wow! Look at that! Park coverage is awful! Why? Okay, well let's get, let's get some parks, baby! Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. All right. Um, a park right here would be nice, maybe. Do you think? Or right here. Yeah, you. Go away, buddy. Because you're going to be a park. 
Let's find a nice little park that will fit in there. Nope, too big. Nope, too big. You? Still too big. Sunken Plaza. Yeah. There we go. Made everyone there happy. Hey, cool. All right, so we just need to intersperse some parks, baby. And then I think we're going to ding up. So I'll do that and uh, then finish up this episode. So maybe in uh, here we can have one of these cool sunken plazas. That's cool. Look at that. What's wrong with you? What is that? What's the deal with you? Oh, I missed. <laughs> That's the deal with you. Okay. So they got a really cool, interesting plaza there. Looks like this guy's dinging up. Yeah, look at you. He just hit level two. Moving on up. Okay, and then... Ooh, you know what? I have this cool little fancy pedestrian bridge. Can I cross stuff? Does it... Is it only for, like, a river, maybe? I don't know. Interesting. Okay, and then... A narrow path. Parking garage? Do parking garages count as parks? Do they? I don't know. Let's see. Can I build one right here? It didn't really spread the happiness. But hey, I got a parking garage. Okay. Alright, real quick, let's uh, build some more parks and then let's end this episode. You guys need a park at the corner, I think. I'm going to have to tear down a couple buildings for this. Yep, there we go. But you got to crack some eggs to make an omelet, right? Look, at everyone's like white now. Is that... was? No, they all upgraded. That's why. It, oh, very cool. They're all like getting a nice little paint job. Okay. What's this plaza with picnic tables so everyone can have their lunches? Maybe smack that down right in the middle here. Let's give these guys some, uh, I say guys. Let's give everyone some like a walking path to get to it. All right, well, I think uh, I figured out how to round off and round up and get, I think, half of Newberryville is pretty much set up. Um, still going up. I'm about 300 or so. 3,000 citizens from being a capital city. Very cool. But uh, I think that's it for this episode. We're pushing the 21, 22 minute mark, I think, if I edit this down. Um, so if you like this video, if you enjoyed my cool, casual, uh, super MLG Pro gameplay. Give me a like, maybe even a subscribe if I've earned it, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of City Skylines. Thanks, guys. Bye.